delegation would be Greg Lizzo, who is a participant for the Coaching for Hope program. Thank you for being with us. Thank you for bidding for the World Cup 2018. Um, thank you, President Blatter, uh, for the chance uh, to be here today and the chance to be involved in this bid for 2018. That we have running through our country, you know, in every town, in every city, um, every team will turn up and they will have their own fans for 2018. Just one question because I see, speaking about also the governmental by the new Prime Minister. I think everyone involved in the bidding is, is serious competitors, you know, it's a competition like the President said and, uh, you know, as English we're very passionate and we're very, you know, uh, we're, we're ready for a competition. Today and nine other presentations and I don't think President, again, if, if I could hand this to you, and uh, as I said, that uh, I hope and pray that uh, we may be the lucky country. I hope and pray that... Uh... Well, we feel very good about our, our chances. Uh, we're confident that we've got a, a, an exceptional technical bid. Um, I think in the last two years we've made a very strong impression uh, with FIFA uh, members across the globe. So, you know, we feel confident about our position, but uh, it's a tough contest. Japanese FA President Motoaki Inukai, General Secretary Kozo Tajima, Managing Director of the BID, Takato Maruyama, and... And by uh, watching the side, just keep it just the competition is at high level. It is football. And it. <laughs> We present you the seven great goals. We try to uh, give uh, two million bikes uh, to all the fans so they can use uh, to go to, from uh, place to place if they want. It's also the fact how they build the stadiums, how they're going to rebuild the stadiums, some of them also, in an, uh, that's more greener than it, than it has been. So you save, you save money and you save the environment. So that's an uh, uh, important statement. It's not only creating a world championship is trying to start to change a little the way of living. Get the children a better possibility in their lives. Because sports, that's what they do. It, turns you to, it, it tells you to win, to lose, to accept everything. And that's why sport is so very important in society. This will give a great message to the rest of the world that uh, a country which comes out of um, all these difficulties of war, uh, division, uh, poverty uh, can now uh, stage a very successful, flawless and enjoyable uh, World Cup.